I know nothing. I know nothing. Elliot, what's going on in there? What's Callie doing? Mm, uh, you know, things. I know, but I know nothing. <laughs> Sorry, uh, I have to go. What's happening in there, Lisa? Uh, uh, in there? Um, it's private, baby bot, uh, you know? But I know nothing! <sighs> they won't tell me anything! What are they doing in there? Launching translation. Don't worry, baby bot. We'll tell you. This strange place is hiding something inside. A toilet. Do you know what a toilet is, baby bot? Nope. Okay, pay attention. The toilet is a container we use when we have to <clears throat> pee or poop. Well, I specifically don't. But you living beings do. Fascinating. Yes. And remember the most important thing. After using the toilet, wipe, flush, and wash with soap. 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 I would if I had hands or a bottom. Oops, sorry, Billy. Wipe, flush, and wash with soap. Wipe, flush, and wash with soap. Wipe, flush, and wash with soap. Yes! That was a great explanation! Go, Billy! Best song ever. <laughs> <laughs> Stop! Have you wiped? You wash your hands. Mm, um, well, uh. Let's see those hands. They are not clean. Go wash those hands with salt. Your hands? Billy says he didn't go to the bathroom. I'll fix that. Well, if you don't need to go... 
we will wait. That's right, Billy. We'll wait. Take your time. Ah, I'm so jealous. Ah, this is going to be exciting. I just love show business. Yes, sorry. Number one, you're up. Time for number two. Not bad, but Billy, I have a lot of hidden talents, you know. I recite poetry, sing, tell jokes. You just have to give me a chance. Please, Billy, I want to be famous. Ah, uh, fine then. Number three's turn. <laughs> You're number four. It's your turn. At least you have a chance, unlike me. Now it's your turn! Now it's your turn, Howie! <laughs> okay. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Twinkle, twinkle, little Thank you. And now, a joke. What do you call a fly that lands on the butter? A butterfly. Ah. 
<laughs> Thank you. Thank you. This is the happiest day of my life. Good afternoon, baby bot. It is good to see you. Oops. Sorry, Billy. Launching translation. You come from a long line of robots, baby bot. Each designed to do different things. Behold, this is one of the first robots called an automaton. It was made of metal and powered by steam, which made it super strong. Automatons could only do one thing at a time, but not for long. Soon, robots became more advanced, like this arm bot that builds cars. Eventually, robots were able to go through complex obstacle courses. <laughs> 
And last but not least, the best of the best, the cream of the crop, the greatest robot in history. This robot can laugh and dance. I can do that. And sing. <gasps> I can do that too. And love. <laughs> I'm the best robot. Of course you are, baby bot. M me? How touching. We made you with love. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. Would you like a photo, sir? A little to the left. Mm, too far. To the right? More to the right. Not too much. Left. Left. There. Now go up a bit. Up. Oops, too high. Down. 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 Not so much. Up. That's it. Left. Up. Right. Down. Up. Right. Right. Left. Right. Launching translation. Cowie, baby bot, you are mistaken. No one is eating the moon. The moon is in the last quarter. Uh, the last quarter? It is simply in the waning phase. Don't you know anything about the moon? I know nothing. The moon is the Earth's natural satellite. Anything that moves around a planet is called a satellite. We only see part of the moon where the sun shines. Depending on where it is in relation to Earth at any given time, that's why sometimes it looks like it's missing a piece. No one is eating the moon, it's just the shadow. 
Does that make sense? Preparing rocket launch to the moon. Rocket ready. Take off in three, two, one. This is fun. On the surface of the moon, we weigh a lot less than on Earth. Oh, that's a lovely flag. Lisa, Lisa, we were on the moon. And we were floating in this hole. And nobody's eating it. And we put a flag on it. And, and, oh, nobody would believe that. Give it back. Give it back. Thank you. I know the moon. Now it is time to go. Sad. I'm sure they do like your hats. Really? Well, um, yes? Yes, you just have to put them in order by size. In order? Do you know how to do that? My processor can calculate 12,000 trillion data points per second. Yes. I think I can correctly order hats by size. Elliot needs a big sized hat. Lisa needs a medium sized 
and Billy needs a small sized hat, but Elliot is wearing a small hat. So he should wear the big hat. Lisa's head is medium sized, so she should wear the medium sized hat. <laughs> And Billy's head is the smallest, so he needs. Why do you call them spring hats? Because they're spring hats. <gasps> oh, they were pretty before, but now they're beautiful. <laughs> These are the best hats in the world. Wonderful! Oh, joy! I know nothing! Launching translation. Indeed, that is not a chicken bone. That would be ridiculous. What we have here is a dinosaur bone. Dinosaurs. Don't make stuff up. That's a chicken bone. I am not making stuff up. Don't you know anything about dinosaurs? I know nothing. I will show you. Millions of years ago, dinosaurs ruled the earth. There were dinosaurs everywhere, in the land, sea, and sky. And they came in all sizes. All sizes? Like chicken sized? Well, actually, yes. Like this small Comsognathus, <laughs> the fastest dinosaur of all. Why was it running so fast? Probably running away from that. Hello. <laughs> the Tyrannosaurus Rex is the fiercest predator of all the dinosaurs. Predator what? Predator. It means that it can eat us. Don't be afraid. Not all dinosaurs were predators. This Titanosaurus, for example, is an herbivore. It eats plants. I like the Titanosaur. Also, the Titanosaurus was the biggest dinosaur of all. It was as tall as four elephants. Chickens is that? Calculating. 32. 
as tall as 32 chickens. Enough about chickens. I am talking about dinosaurs. They don't have anything to do with chickens. They're dinosaurs. Di-no-sores. The word means terrible lizard because at first people thought they belonged to the lizard family. But now we know that some of them were actually great, 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 great grandparents of today's birds. Birds? For example, could be, maybe, a chicken? Yes, technically, they were birds, like chickens. Chicken bone. 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 Chicken Oh, look, it's Billy. I wonder where Cowie is. Play! I think Billy is waiting for something. Oh, maybe that's it. I wonder... Of course! You're going to build a robot for the contest, right? Oh, this is going to be fun! I think Billy is saying it's time to build, not to play. Angry Cowie. He just wants to build a great robot. <laughs> oh, Cowie. I don't know if that's such a good idea.
Oh boy. I didn't say anything. Sorry, Billy. We have to be practical, Billy. The contest is about to start. Why don't we give him a chance? Billy. The rest of the robots aren't so good. Don't worry, Billy. The rest of the robots aren't so good. wrong. <laughs> Math test. What is the mass of the universe? Correct. Strength test. What is the answer to life, the universe, and everything? Forty two. Correct. Math test. You got it? Oh. How about this? You got it? <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Poor robot.
Congratulations, everyone! Bye-bye! More songs, activities, and podcasts on our YouTube channels.